Hey, how you doing today? I am Tequila Coleman. Today is day, day 73 of our 90 days of prayer. For day 73, we are praying against negative thinking, okay? Listen, in um in the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 5, it tells us to cast down, it's a casting down imagination in every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of God and bring it into captivity every thought to the obedience of Christ. What this scripture is basically saying to us as believers is that every thought, every imagination that exalt itself higher than what God said. So when that thought comes that tell you this is not going to happen for you, it's just too good to be true. When that thought comes to have you doubt and second guess what God has said, this scripture is telling us we are to cast that thought, these thoughts down, okay? We are to tell the devil, get thee behind me, and we are to become intentional about replacing these negative thoughts that's trying to exalt itself higher than what God has already said, we got to become intentional with our thoughts and begin to replace that thought with what God said, replace that thought with what you want to believe about the situation. Okay. I want everyone to become intentional with how you are thinking. Okay. Do not sit there and allow the devil to attack your mind. Don't sit there and allow the devil to bring to your mind depressing thoughts. Try not to sit there and think about all of what went wrong in your past. No, the devil is a lie. You want to begin to rebuke off this negative thinking, um, negative you know, thoughts out of your mind and become intentional with the way you are thinking. Become intentional with your thoughts, okay? Uh, and it all starts with awareness. It starts with us becoming aware of, okay, this is the current thought that I am thinking of. I don't like this thought. I don't like how this thought is making me feel. It's, it's starting to make me feel like I'm not good enough. It's starting to make me question my God. And so because I don't want to think this way or feel this way, I now have to do something about it. Okay. This is how we begin to get in control of our mindset and kick the devil out of our thoughts. Okay. So let's go to God in prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you, Father, that you are a great, great Father. We thank you for making us aware of our thoughts that the devil, you know, sends to our mind, Father. You said that we are to cast down every imagination and every high thing that exalt itself against the knowledge of God and bring into captivity every thought to the obedience of Christ. So, Father, we ask and pray that you will help us to cast down these imaginations. We ask that you will help us to become aware of our thoughts when we are thinking negative thoughts, when we are thinking thoughts that come from the, uh, the, the demonic realm. Father, help us to become aware of our thinking and to cast these thoughts down in the name of Jesus Christ and teach us how to think on your thoughts, how to think on whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable. If anything is excellent or praiseworthy, we will think on such things, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. So we thank you, Father, that you are giving us a mind of Christ. We thank you, Father. We rebuke this negative thinking, negative thoughts off of our mindset in the name of Jesus Christ. And we take every thought that doesn't line up with the word of God. We take it captive and we make it obedient to the word of God in the name of Jesus Christ. We pray. Amen.